Hey, what's going on, Ogopogo? Back and hold your own. Thank you very much for taking time out of your day to come and hang out with me. Do appreciate it. Hope everybody's doing well. So we got back to, uh, got everything put away, had a little bit of a sleep. We need to top up on a little bit of food. And uh, you know what? I was concentrating on these prickly pears. I forgot I got a bunch of bread here that we got to use up for carbs as well. So kind of dropped the ball on that one, but hey, whatever. And let's uh, have a bandage or two here to heal up. There's some baddies up ahead of us here. So let's go. I think what we're going to do is loot this uh, little area here. Then we're going to hop in the old 4x4 four four and head up and go check out one of the mines or a couple of the mines up here and see what kind of resources we got in them. So let's do uh, start doing a bunch of looting around here. See what we can find. Probably not going to take long to fill up. I kept all the stuff on me that we get from these uh, insurgents. Look at that. We're almost full already. Holy crap. Oh, well, we'll get what we can get. We'll toss away what we think we don't really need. As usual. Same old, same old. Lots of carbs in here. That's for sure. Splints. All right. Keep an eye on these guys. I might have to grab the... I can't get up here with the Jeep. I'd have to come... Uh... Come around. Looks like. Ah, uh, some meat, hey? Uh, you know what? I got so much meat. I'm not going to worry too much about that. Beakers. I wonder if we start hanging on to them now that we got this chemistry station. You know, the chemistry station here. Let's take that. A little more gold. Oh, we definitely want the copper. Uh, let's get rid of these cans. Take the copper. And we'll get rid of that. We'll take that. I didn't check to see if those have been decreased with the new economy either. Ooh, cloth. Definitely want that. And I'm going to hang on to this water because... Well, mind you, we got 50 bottles. We should be okay. Um, actually, you know what? Like that can go. I'm not too worried about that kind of stuff. Murky water. What I should do is go put this bow and this pickaxe in the truck or in the vehicle. You know what? These casings, let's just get rid of them. They're not worth that much anymore. You know, when they were uh, worth a buck each or whatever, it was all right. But now that you got to get so many, I think they're a quarter each or something. Which just stands to reason. I'm not complaining about it. Makes a lot more sense. Oh, you know what? Some more prickly pears. Sure, a ton of those around. It's only one whack, so why not? Let's whack away. <laughs> Hey, Johnny. Hey, boys. Nice to have you around. Oh, yeah, I brought that fuel, too, to throw on the, uh, on the Jeep as well. Yeah, these not worried about. This ammo. I got a ton of that ammo kicking around. Let's not worry about it. Let's get this... Mama Sita over here. I'll kill you. Oh, she got one shot of me. Look at all the prickly pears here. Holy shit. I didn't realize there's this many over here. I guess so. It's in the desert, right? How many you get in there? Just two? When oh, you get five or two, right? Fiber I'm not collecting because I'm full. Look at this. Not like I need it. I mean, I got a ton of friggin' prick or uh, carbs on me right now. 
but we'll get them just because we're standing right here. Let's go back to the Jeep and throw some stuff in and get this sorted out. We're going to have to take our vest off here because we are hurting. We can't really do much until we... Ah, uh... oh, man. Yeah, we got to get over to the Jeep pronto. You know what? I think I might bring the Jeep over here. Here's a dude over here. Did you just go inside? Oh, well, they go right up the stairs and everything. That's awesome. I didn't realize they did that. All right, we gotta haul ass because I'm dying here. It's so hot. Oh no. I can get around this way. <laughs> Yeah, we don't need to empty I don't know why I empty them out. Just have it, I guess. All right. Let's get... Uh, let's put our bow there, the fuel there, the pickaxe. Can actually unload a bunch of this stuff. Let's do... Uh, whoop, keep the cloth on us. Let's get all this uh, stuff we pick up off of these guys out of here. And some of this stuff. Well, mind you, that stuff will probably collect, right? We can keep doing that. First of all, let's get our uh, vest off before we die here. Keep that right there so we can see it. Do we still have some spots on here? Yeah, we got some room still. Uh, keep that. Stuff like the beakers, the clay ingots. The rest of it, I think, would be all right. Splints will kind of take off. Let's go uh, try to drive our car around so we're up here so we can... Get ourselves. So we got to... So it's easily accessible. I don't have to keep running all the way down here. Oh, yeah. I think I'll go around this way. What the hell is that? Oh, a wolf. Ah, oh, great. Well, that wolf didn't uh, stick around long. He's caught on the... I'm not going to worry about cleaning him out. We'll just get Screamer Boy here. All right. Let's get back to business here. We've got lots to take care of. We're going to try to get up to those caves if we can. Oh, wow. Yeah, here we go with the food again. Well, we'll just keep collecting it. We'll check... Accordingly. Definitely got to set up a base over here too. If we're going to be coming back over here. Hey, is that going to cool things off a little bit? The weather system worked that way. I'm going to chuck that right away. Oh. And oh, there we go with one of these uh awesome dinners. Let's take that back. Let's just chuck all this. Actually, you know what? How are we doing on our time on this thing? We still got an hour and forty on that, so forget about it. And we do here. Carbohydrates is full. Okay. Need another drink or two. What else we got we can chuck? These we can chuck, right? I want that fertilizer. Oh, wow. Another one of these things. Let's take 
that and that actually you know what that bacon can go we'll hang on to that screw mold i'll just eat these guys ah well we can get the screw mold at least don't cross me whoa where the hell is he <gasps> scared the shit out of me dude dan is that you Huh? <laughs> Let's get rid of these cans. Take the fuel. I kind of want these because they're worth a few bucks. The bullet. So are the bullet. Well, now the bullet tips aren't worth jack shit. Okay, hang on a second here. Man, this juggling around. You know what? I'm going to open up another slot here too. Why not? What else we got we can dump in here? I don't know. God damn, there's just... It doesn't matter what you do. Actually, that stack of nails is almost done, so let's do that. Let's go back and grab this guy here. I want those guys. He scared the living shit out of me. Well, let's throw those out. We got everything else, right? Wait a sec. Was I in the oven? What? No. All right. Let's move on to the next place here. I'm really kind of uh, eager to get up to one of those caves. So if we get filled up here, we might have to, uh, crocodile oil. Wait a second. Can I uh, eat that? Yeah, I can. You know what? We'll get rid of that. Medical herbs. Wouldn't mind hanging on to those. We got some of that on us. Yeah, I want to check these places out because, you know, we're running across different workbenches and stuff, and I don't know if there's a possibility that we could, uh, Find another one kicking around these parts somewhere. Uh, I'm going to chuck that. There we go. I know I shouldn't chuck the carbs, but I'm really not having any problems with them at all. Oh, do I got some uh, jars of water on me? That murky water? We got more bottled water out in the boat as well, so I'm really not struggling for water at all. Alright, this place is done. At least the temperature's staying down. I don't mind this rain if, the, if it means the temperature's gonna stay down. All right, let's go check this building out here. Can we, uh, is there anything we can drop off in here? Let's go through and spam it. Oh, we got a couple slots emptied out. Actually, too, let's take a look at our points here. We got a lot of points. Oh, the glass jar can go. What do we got going on here? We got eight. Let's open up another uh, inventory slot. So we only need one more to go. We only have one more to go. That's going to help out. We'll be maxed out then. And I'll be crying, seeing if we can make ourselves a backpack. Uh, come on with this water. I think some of those like jars of murky water and stuff i think those could be toned down a little bit but i shouldn't say that i don't know how the balance is on the coding end so i'll just shut up i won't say anymore salt we could probably get rid of if we have to really not too keen on uh, worrying about 
we look through all these already? Yeah, it looks like it. Anything up in here? Yes, sir. Nice. Oh, saving uh, lag there. Time is at 9.09. Well, well, maybe check this building out and then we'll take a dip up to those caves. I'm really uh, kind of eager to see what's uh, what's up, what's going on up there. Oh, there's some more fertilizer. Awesome. Oh, and another repair kit. out here holy crap make it down on this side cool if we can find another uh couple benches kicking around I sense danger where the hell are you mm, I sense danger where the hell are you I don't know if I'm gonna get through this apartment block here today Let's check and see what's on this side. He must be up on the roof, eh? What's going on here? Kill you. Where are you? How about if I kill you? Little cage is kind of cool. Oh, can't we get in there? No way. What kind of, uh... Bullshit is that? Can't get in these cages. What's the point in having them there? I mean, they they look good for sure. Here, I thought I was gonna hit the jackpot with all these barrels. Oh well, screw you then. I'm going home. Screw you guys. I'm going home. Don't cross me. Where are you? Oh, you're over here. I thought you were up top, dude. Oh, wow. I didn't know I was in that bad of shape. Uh, let's get rid of the flower. Pistol barrel. Those are worth a few bucks. Wait a second. Was there uh Oh, I could eat that guy. No. All right. Yeah, we can keep that. Let's uh, heal ourselves up here. Didn't realize I was that late. Yeah, good enough. All right. You know what? I think we've had enough here. We've got to come back and hit this apartment block. Maybe I'll hit that before I take off on the boat. We got all through here, I think. I, I might have missed something. It's a pretty big building. Or did I hit this side? I don't know if I did or not. No, guess not. And... Oh yeah, right, I got salt on me I could chuck, I guess. Is this the one we came down? It is. Okay, so we've been through here. All right, it was just this front end I didn't get. Let's uh, go grab the Jeep and let's head up to uh, these caves and check it out. Wow, so there's the garage. It seems like there's usually a garage around these caves, eh? Let's go check it out. through it. There's a bunch of houses up in behind here too. There's lots to loot. Might have to do some of that off camera. I want these alloy. For sure. 
For sure, for sure. There, these can go. Get all this stuff. Yeah, I might have to do uh, some looting off camera around here. Because there's a bunch of houses up in behind here too. And we still got that apartment block to go. Oh, man. I throw the cans and then I pick more up. And then I'm throwing them and then I pick more up. And there's some more copper. Good. Yeah, we've got to keep stocked up on that. All right, now, here's the problem. I'm going to have to chuck a bunch of stuff. Because I'm going to need uh, some room for whatever we're going to go in here and mine. I guess in the cave, I could probably put my vest back on. I don't know. I'll just spam this out and see if we can clear some of it out. All right, so I had a bit of a change of plans. I went back to the boat. I just wasn't able to uh, clear any space without sacrificing a bunch of stuff. So I just went back to the boat, dumped off a bunch of stuff that we already had in there and uh, cleared up quite a bit of space. So now we can go hit up this mine. Okay, let's grab uh, this extra pickaxe. Now let's turn on our light. Let's go in and see what kind of resources we get in this cave. A little bit of copper. I saw another spider there. There it is. All right. Let's go check off to our right here. That's where we came in, right? Yeah. Ah, these guys might as well. More copper. Oh, it looks like some cobalt in here, too. So this could be good. We're going to be able to get this guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, thought I was going to crack on that one. All right. Oop. Get out of this section. Oh, come on. Yeah, this cave looking all right so far. Cobalt at least. And some copper, which is good. We do need more of this stuff. Need aluminum too. Did I see some? Yeah, there's some aluminum here too. And some iron. So this is like a multi one. Apparently different islands are going to have different resources in the caves. Look at all the spiders in here. I like how they flip on their back just when they're getting nailed. Well, I guess that's kind of standard procedure for most living beings, eh? <laughs> that's good. We need the aluminum. So this is going to be a pretty beneficial run. Man, we're going to be loaded to the nuts, though. Definitely got to put up a base over here. Whoa. Just flew off the ceiling, eh? Oh, is this a uh, magnesium? Yeah. All right. Well, let's keep moving along this thing here. Go back to uh, the little entry here.
Ah, yeah, I'm gonna go down this way. Is there anything down below? I'll go take a look. Lots going on in here. I'm digging it. Literally. We need all this stuff. We're gonna need a ton of aluminum for uh well we don't need much more aluminum for the the found or the uh workshop, but oop. we definitely oh there's some of that uh oil as well. But we need some more to put down the workbench, the workshop workbench as well. So we're definitely gonna need to beef up all. Okay, I wanna, we'll take a run through here. I think it just goes to a dead end anyway. Yeah, all right. Let's go back up, I wanna get that aluminum. Oh, I missed a uh, copper over here too. Ran right past it. Let's go back over this way. We'll get this aluminum. Go back through this back passage. Cobalt there as well. Beautiful. How are we holding up here? We have to. I'll buy another, uh, that last four slots. And then we're done with it. Want to save some points though, because we're going to need it to unlock the workshop and the workshop bench and all that other stuff. Lovely. Lovely. Okay, just the copper in this one. This room. Man, this helmet sure is a game changer, eh? Man, you can't beat it. Glad we found another flashlight so we can make another one if we have to. So far, though, I'm wondering if he's tweaked the uh, usage as well because it doesn't seem to be going down quite as fast. I'm taking some shots as well. You know what I mean? Oh, I didn't put the vest on. I could probably... Well, you know what? I'm going to leave it off because once we get outside even, it's going to be... I mean, that's going to bring it up another six, I think it is. So that's going to be pretty close to the... What the hell's going on with this thing? There we go. Yeah, I'd be okay down here, but then we're going to have to uh, take it back off and get outside anyway, so we might as well just leave it in there and occupy that slot. Oh, there's some more aluminum. That's awesome. How are we sitting on aluminum? 126. That's cool. That's like 105... Or sorry, 25 uh, ingots. Is that it for this area? I think so, hey? Okay, yeah, that's the exterior. I think we just got this one side over here to do yet. I think we came back through here, though, already once, but we'll just double check it. Oh, I guess we did miss this. We should be able to get through the other one by midnight. And maybe a possibility of going through them a second time before we head back home. So we'll see how that goes. Because I'm not opposed to doing another run through the caves if it means uh, going home with a major haul. Just a matter of whether we got room or not. But you know what? I'll sacrifice some stuff for the ore. I'm not afraid. That's it for this one, hey? All right. Well, I guess that's going to do it for this cave. Let's take one more look through here. We go up and over this way. I think so, right? Oh, 
saving leg. Yeah. Yeah, we've been all through here. Okay. Yeah, I might as well get him. Oh, there's one hidden behind here. Good thing we came down and looked. Let's stop and have something neat too. We could probably clear a couple spots with some of this uh, veg and stuff we got going on here. Ah, uh, get up there. Okay, one potato, two potato. Let's throw that up there. And we can use this protein. We got to get that consumed here pretty quick too. So that tops that up. Let's have a bunch of water. Good enough. All right. Where were we? I think we went through here. Yeah, we went all through this way. Okay, I think we've got it cleared out now. I think. All right, let's take a look and see how we actually did in there. Got 105 copper, 69 iron. This stone we can chuck. 54 uh, oil, 178 aluminum, which is awesome. 77 cobalt. So yeah, not too shabby. So let's take a look at where we got ahead uh, to the next one. It's just up the hill here a little ways, isn't it? Is there a road that goes up there? Doesn't look like it, eh? We got the 4x4. Four four. If we can make it up this hill and just go up and over. Yeah, let's give it a shot. Try that. There's another uh, little area here we're going to have to loot. Like I said, I might do that off camera before we... Uh, head back let's see if I can get up this hill so four by four should be able to a little slow she's chugging along pretty good it's all this friggin ore I got on me that's slowing things down what's that a cow I think just straight down this way now I think a little unsure of this territory. <laughs> Just run him over. Too bad you didn't get the XP. Be like Death Race 2000. Oh, here's another garage. So the mine's got to be around here somewhere. I must have missed it. Go back on this side. Oh, there it is right there. All right, I'll run through this one and see what we end up with. All right. Well, we didn't do too terrible. I did run down here and I came out for uh, to dump, see if I could dump a few things off and do some sorting. I hit the garage up. We didn't do too terrible. We got 185 cobalt, 180 copper, 109 of the oil. 344 aluminum, which is awesome. And 78 magnesium, 69 iron. And so what I'm thinking here, I was going to do some looting. But like we're completely filled up. Both my storage containers inside the uh, boat are filled up. The car is filled up. So I think what we might do. Oh, I just picked that can up again. I think what we might do is go jump on the boat, head back home. And it's actually pretty good to know that this island here and this one here and this one here are both uh, similar as far as the caves go. So I think what we're going to do, we got our base over here. We're going to toss one over here. And just have a little outpost. And I think I'll uh, we'll run back home, drop a bunch of this stuff off, and over the next couple episodes, 
we'll come back over here, build a little base, and we can come and loot the rest of this place and hit these caves again. We've got what we need as far as the repair kit, so we can go and get those to stand. I might even just stop by on the way home. Let's see what kind of a pain in the ass that would be. Yeah, I could just skip around and go drop those off to stand to get that quest completed. And then we could head home and get a bunch of this stuff refined so we can start working on our workshop and stuff like that. I'm kind of excited about that to see uh, what we can do with it. So let's do that. Let's head back to the boat. I may meet you just back either uh, when we go see Stan or... Uh, first thing in the morning because I can take a sleep on the boat and bring morning in because actually we can do that right away to be honest with you We'll just leave our boat out on this or our car out on this dock for now Let's see what we got in here that we can actually carry It's a bunch of stuff that's got to go to the trader Uh, we're just going to have to leave it for the time being, I think, to be honest with you. I'm just going to leave it for the time being. Let's hop on the boat, have a sleep, and then we'll uh, take off in the morning, go see Stan. All right. I just finished spamming to see what I can put away. Clear a few slots. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to spend one more point and get this last inventory slot opened up. And then we should be able to grab everything that's on the 4x4 on the four four here. And take it with us. We'll leave the fuel in here. I can't take it all, hey? Well, that's not huge, but I wouldn't mind taking. We need a lot of electrical parts to build that stuff. Let's swap that out. Let's swap the beaker out with that, and the rest can stay. Let's, uh... We'll leave that fuel in here. And you know what? I'm going to swap that bow out. We'll take a full one with us. Because that's going to run out pretty quick. Anyways, we'll just keep a partial one on there for now. We can always chuck it later. Ah, oh, for crying out loud, I'll go... Really getting bad at missing these things. All right. There we go. Let's uh, set our waypoint. Um, let's do it over here at our other place. There we go. All right. I'll meet you guys back over at Stan's. Yeah, it just dawned on me when I was uh, coasting around. We had to come home anyways first because uh, we only have 23 repair kits on us. The rest of them we need to uh, pick up from home here. So we'll stop, make a pit stop here at home. I'll put a bunch of this stuff away and then we'll go over and see Stan. Stan the man. Okay, so let's get, uh, I'm going to put a bunch of this stuff away, but we'll get a bunch of this stuff refining down. We're going to need, let's see what we can do with aluminum ingots. 69 of them. Might as well. Oh, there's no fuel. Uh, I got some fuel over. Oh, wait, I got coal on me, don't I? Yeah, that's good. That works good. And aluminum ingots. Let's craft those guys up. Get those working. Might as well get some more cobalt going as well. And cobalt. There we go. 37 more of those. Get some copper going. 
and this iron we can or oil we can put in and get some oil refining. We're gonna need some iron ingots too, I think. Ah, uh, iron. There we go. Get that going. Where's our uh, little bench here? Let's throw that in and get a bunch of oil going. If we need more later down the road for something else with this oil shale, then we'll uh, figure it out. We'll go get some more, but for now we'll get some oil cracking off. And magnesium. We'll keep that in here. All right, I'll get the rest of this stuff put away and then we'll uh, go see Stan, Stan the man. All right, I think we got everything put away. I'm all topped up. We got Stan's 40 repair kits. So let's bomb back over to uh, this island over here. And then we'll go see Stan. Let's get this baby fired up. And away we go. Come on, turn around, big guy. I just gotta make a beeline straight across here. I love this little island hop and think we'll get this boat cranked up a little bit more too. Actually, you know what? Let's take a look at that right now. Ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Sometimes I gotta find. I gotta open a crate so my things will work here. Yeah, we got seven points left, so let's uh, increase this a little bit more. We're three out of five on that. We should be hauling ass here pretty soon. Oh, yeah. Look at us go. We could probably just roar right over the island or to the other side of the ocean there. Awesome. All right. Oh, I forgot to shut it off. Once again. Should have it in the other view so I can keep it on that light. Light goes red. Let's just make sure. Yeah, we're good. All right, Stan, here we come, man. Are you kidding me, man? What is with me and trying to land this goddamn jump from these boats? <laughs> I just can't hit it. I should build little ramps up or something. All right. Oh, yeah. Stan's in the coffee shop here. I wonder if he can knock on the window. Let's go say hi to him. See if he sees us and waves. Is he going to wave to us? Hey, Stan. I'm right here, buddy. Uh, he didn't even flinch. He's busy spacing out from those brownies he ate there earlier. All right. So let's go in and see what he's got to say here. Hey, Stan, how's it going, brother? <laughs> Their facial expression never changes. And neither did Scott's. All right, here you go. The huts. What the hell's the huts? You didn't have nothing to say to us? He is spaced out. Jack needs, oh, here we go. Jack needs our help again. He's waiting for you in a hut. Right here on this island. There's no road to the hut. Find the farm just past the bridge. I think I know where that farm is. That's just coming out from where our, uh, our arms dealer is. I think. And then south on I-66, so you see a sand or stone cairn under a tree side of the road follow a faint gravel path into the woods until you see a sandy cove with the huts you can also follow the coastline until you find the cove All right let's have a peek here uh map okay so just past the bridge there's a farm and i'm thinking it's this one so follow it down There's some houses down there. This has got to be the cove he's talking about. 
Wait in here. All right. Well, we can make a day of it. Next episode, maybe we'll do that. We'll go and see Jack, and then we can hit up these caves while we're up here. Go see the arms dealer while we're passing through that way. There's some, uh, looks like maybe huts down there, but I'm thinking if it's just past. Okay, so here's over the bridge. There's the farm. Follow it down till we see. There's no roads to it. So I'm thinking this must be it down in here somewhere, I think. We'll have to check that out. Well, we'll do that next episode. I might as well stay over here then if that's the case. Our car's still here, right? Yes, it is. And we got fuel for it. We got 22 minutes of fuel on there. All right. Well, that's what we're going to do next episode. I'll hang out here and uh, get some stuff organized. Maybe find some stuff to take to sell over at the trader, the arms dealer. And we'll go see Jack again. Man, this Jack really gets around. But he did say he was coming over here to see Julia, so it makes sense that he's over here somewhere. I kind of figured we'd run into him. And then I'm also thinking we should maybe put together the... Maybe I'll go out and chop some trees and stuff like that while I'm here. Might even run back home and get some nails and crap. And while we're on this side, we might just skip around over here and go throw up a base over on Oraculo there. But we'll see what Jack has to say. All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for this one. Thank you very much for taking time to come and hang out with me. And uh, in the meantime, just be safe. Look after each other. We'll see y'all on the next episode. Take it easy.